Hey guys, what's up? This is GK from TechPP.com and today we'll be doing something very interesting. A gaming review on the latest released Redmi 2. And why are we doing this? This one has a very good capable processor and also has the benchmark scoring of well above 20,000. And we've also seen from our past experience that a lot of people uh, started playing games on the Redmi 1S as well. So more likely uh, with the bumped up specs and with a decent enough screen, gaming is going to be one of the most uh, you know, popular use cases right here. So let's go ahead and test this device for the gaming and also see if this holds well or is it going to give the same issue like the Redmi 1 which used to heat up a lot. So here I have um, the temperature gun with me. We'll take the uh, temperature on this first then do a gaming for about 15 to 20 minutes and then come back and see the temperature to see uh, you know if, it, if it's really shooting up or if it's in the normal range. So it's around 35. It's 35 in two spots. So let's get an average of different places. 34, 35. So it's around about 34. And uh, we also have the provision to check for the temperature inside the MIUI version 6 as well. So here it says 36. And uh, this could also be uh, for the fact that we have lighting around here. So, you know, the temperature is just heated up, but normally it stays around the 33, 34 mark. And that's what it is. So let's start gaming and see how the Redmi 2 performs. So I'll start off with the CSR racing here. And I must admit that uh, the launching of the app and uh, and the processing towards the launch of the game is decent enough. It's not slow. It's around about the same time that we've seen in uh, the Redmi Note and the Mi 4 as well. Mi 4 is much faster, but uh, this is a tad slow. The volume too is, is loud enough. That's my Mini Cooper. And I'm gonna go for the ladder. The effect of the sound is decent enough and, and that's what you need in gaming to entice you when you go for the gaming. So far, so good. Oh, I lost. So I'll probably do another round. So there's no lags, no stutters, no frame drops or anything of that sort. Let me try my luck again. Let me see if I can win this one. Tough luck again, but again you saw it was pretty smooth. No issues at all. Okay, so now I'm gonna close this and let's check for the temperature. That's good, just 36, 35, 35 again. So literally no change in the temperature. Yeah, of course, we just played it for a couple of minutes, but then you know, th that used to be a big issue back in uh, the Redmi 1S. Let's look at the software as well. 37, so it's somewhere between 34 to 36, 37. So which is decent enough, it's not shooting up. So we observed that the temperature was quite okay and it, it, it wasn't shooting off the roof or something of that sort. Another worrisome thing about the Redmi 1S was the way the RAM management was done. So let's see what sort of RAM availability we have here for the one gig of RAM that it has. 
So if you observe, it is around the 250, uh, you know, a megabyte mark and that is available, which is good, you know, uh, much in contrary to the Redmi 1S where almost all of the RAM was getting used up. So Xiaomi has uh, done some improvement on that aspect as well. So let's go right ahead and uh, probably try the asphalt. Again here, smooth loading up, um, no lags or something of that sort. So we will be playing this game for about uh, a slightly longer duration than we did with the CSR and try to see how it fares and also look at the temperature as well. I'm generally not a good gamer, so if I end up crash landing or somewhere, <laughs> that's what you would see. It's taking a bit to load up. All right. Here we go. So the setting that we're using here is default, we didn't meddle with it at all. It's the medium setting that comes out of the box, um, so we'll show you that as well. Whoa, whoa. I think I'm gonna... Oops, I'm good. Okay, I'm right. I'm back. So I've crossed that level, let me go to the next level here. So you can see the stutter there. There you go. And again. And again. Oops. It's struggling a bit now. Struggling. There you go again. So we've already crossed around uh, 15 minutes of playing this game and uh, let's go ahead and see the temperature. Oops, it's gone up to 42, 41 there, 41, 41, 42. So it's around about the 40 to 42 mark. And let's look at the temperature on the software as well. So we did see some stutters, some lags, and it did start struggling. And uh, the temperature is shot up as well, but not as much as the way we were looking at in the Redmi 1S. So the temperature has shot up to 46. Um, that's what the software says, but overall, uh, probably it's around the 42, 43 mark, uh, which is still acceptable because it's an intensive game and we were playing for about 15 to 20 minutes. 
So overall, uh, the gaming performance looks to be okay, though we saw the starters and all that because extended the uh, duration of play for a device that has just one GB RAM. And uh, yeah, of course I closed the game. Now it's around the 345 mark because it's on pause. It's not using anything up. So overall, the RAM management seems to have improved a lot. Um, and also the gaming as well with occasional starters. Uh, we saw that it started starting at the start of the game, but it started improving as it moved on. So do expect such things, but then that is only in very high intensive games. So overall, gaming is okay. We would uh, probably rate it somewhere between uh, 7 and 7.5. Um, you know, nothing above that. And come on guys, it's just 6,999. And um, that is what you're gonna get with this. So overall, kudos to Xiaomi on uh, bringing about these improvements in the successor to the Redmi 1S. We'll be back with uh, more detailed reviews of uh, the camera and so on. So until the next one, this is GK from techpp.com signing off. Do subscribe and hit the like button if you like this. Thank you.